like the time you borrowed my baseball. Filet will still be wanting to play. Or my blanket. Make fort. Sneakers. Needed something smelly. I think you took it. Nuh-uh! Then what else could have happened to it? Ugh, my hat. Where's my hat? Oh, it's my bedtime spoon. I can't sleep without it. There, there, Harold. We'll help you find your missing spoon. And we won't give up till we do. I'll totally help. I'm a great finder of stuff. Well, except for my favorite hat. But Mabel took it, so that's different. <gasps> Maybe someone took your spoon, Harold. <gasps> but who would do such a thing? Not any of us. I find when I want to know something, I like to ask questions. Yeah, like a detective. Okay, Harold, do you think the dish ran away with the spoon? Wait, what? A dish took my spoon? What did you and the spoon talk about the last time you saw it? It's a spoon. Spoons don't talk. Hmm. Why is the sky blue? Um, what does that have to do with my missing spoon? Nothing, but I always wondered. Um, Pancake, I'm not sure these particular questions are helping. Why don't we just ask, where did you last see the spoon? Why, in front of my house! To Harold's house! Don't worry, Harold. We'll find your spoon if we keep trying. We sure will! So, how do we figure out who swiped Harold's spoon? We're still not sure that's what happened. What we need to do is look for clues as to where the spoon might be. Right. Questions first. Clues next. I just wish I had my magnifying glass to look with. I can help with that. <sighs> Oops. Must have thought a little too hard. This is perfect. Aha! I wondered where I left that. I was gonna eat that with my pie spoon. Aha! Where'd that come from? I never use forks. Too forky. I'm more of a spoon bear. <laughs> We've noticed, Harold. Aha! Feet friends! Maybe from a spoon snatcher! Let's follow them and see where they lead. And who they lead to! <laughs> These feet prints are Harold's? Did you snatch your own spoon? Oh, stars and spoons! I'd never take a spoon that wasn't mine. <sighs> then I'm stuck. What do we do now? Keep trying. There is a third thing to try. Do the things that Harold did from the beginning of his day. That sounds like a good idea. So what was the first thing you did? Why, what I always do first. I wake up. Then what? Well... I polished my spoons. Then what? I made a spoon souffle and ate it with... A spoon! Then what? I picked spoons from my spoon tree. Then what? I went back to the front of my house to do my spoon exercises. One, two, three... Still no missing spoon? Wait... I remember one other thing. I dropped my noon spoon. The one I used to tell if it's noon. Oh, fiddle spoons. Look! My sleep spoon. It must have fallen out when I bent over earlier. So, no one swiped it. Hooray for Pancake for helping find it. Hooray for the Zoonicorns for helping me find it. <laughs> this makes me so happy. <laughs> My hat! Still gone. OK, 
Okay, I know I can find it if I keep trying. So, what were the three things we did to find Harold's missing spoon? Ask questions, look for clues, redo the same things he did when he lost his spoon. I bet if I follow those same steps, I can find my lost hat. I gotta take your hat! No, no, I believe you. Sorry I said you did, but I have a question. Where did you last see me with my hat? Um, back yard. Now, to look for clues. Aha! That's right! I had a kite yesterday. Now, what did I do? I ran and it flew and it got caught in a tree! I tried to get my kite now. Hey! 